guys, Mr. Isgin here. Just want to reach out and tell you how much I miss you guys. Can't wait to see you guys here hopefully real soon. Stay safe, stay healthy, and stay strong. We'll get through this together, okay? One thing I found to help keep me safe and healthy during all this is my sons and my dogs and I have been enjoying evening walks. So if you look around here, I have my son Carter playing with some sticks, my dog Huckleberry, my dog Paisley, my puppy Marley, my other son Sean. So stay healthy, stay happy, stay strong. We miss you and we'll see you real soon. Hi Chestnut Ridge Middle School. This is Mrs. Lafferty coming to you from my kitchen. Mm, this recipe is starting to smell really good. From the back seat of my car, this is weird. I never sit back here. From my bedroom, which was probably not a good place to do schoolwork. From my basement, and it's kind of spooky down here. It's really dark. My garage. I think this side by side is calling my name. No matter where your classroom is, enjoy being at home. Stay healthy and safe, guys, and I hope to see you soon. Miss you bunches. Hi, boys and girls. It's Mrs. Grubb, and I just want to tell you today that I miss you. I do. I miss you a lot. I miss um, seeing you in the mornings, and I miss your hugs, and I miss your smiling faces in the hallway, and your laughter, and seeing you with your friends. And I miss teaching you a lot too, and, and hearing your stories, and watching you learn. And I miss the other teachers a lot too. And I miss our special area teachers, and Mrs. Emmerich, and Mrs. Clark and Mrs. Bear and all the ladies in the cafeteria and our ladies in the office, um, Miss Becky and Miss Amy. And I miss Mr. Iskin and Mr. Nisley and seeing Dr. K in the hallways and at the end of the day telling us goodbye. And I miss um, seeing Mr. Wyant in the hallway in the mornings. He always has something funny to say. I miss all of those people and maybe you do too. So I thought I would just tell you how I'm looking at it. And the way I look at it is those things aren't really gone. They're just not here right now, but they'll be back. And when we are back together again, maybe all of these things that we miss so much, all the people, your friends, all the things that make the Chestnut Ridge Middle School so special will mean even more to us since we've been away from it. So uh, I guess in closing, I want to say that I know that your teachers are providing really great lessons for you, and I hope that you're doing your very best because you're only going to get out of it what you put into it. So rise up to the challenges that they're presenting you with and all the challenges that you're facing right now. I know you're going to do great. So I'm not going to end with saying goodbye. Instead, I'm going to say to you, until I see you again, be kind, be safe, and be happy. I will see you later. Hi, Chestnut Ridge. This is Manion and Kersey here. <laughs> Just wanted to tell you how much we missed you. We're sending you puppy kisses. We miss you. <laughs> Hi, this is Mrs. Miller, and I'm coming to you from my living room with my dog, Duke. I just wanted to tell everybody that I miss you very much. And I know that this is really strange right now, but hang in there boys and girls and hopefully we get to see each other very, very soon. Keep up the good work and stay safe. Bye. Hey everyone, this is Miss Rose coming to you live from my dining room table. Now I had to make this into my classroom instead of being at school. I know this is strange for everyone at this time, but I just wanted to remind you that you need to keep going and try your best at this point. I'm still on the lookout to give some pride tickets, even from home. I just wanted to say stay healthy and hopefully we'll get to see each other soon. Bye guys. Bridge Middle School students, Mrs. Selensky here, um, hanging out in front of my bookshelf, trying to find some books that maybe you might like to read 
um, maybe some Narnia, maybe some mysteries. It's a hard time for us to be at home. The weather's not great. Grab a book, sit down, it'll take you anywhere. Enjoy some time reading and um, I hope to see you all soon. One last thing. Hi everyone, Mrs. Gathers here. I hear everyone's doing a great job, so keep up the good work. I hope that you're staying safe and keeping busy. I've been keeping busy with my son Finn, he'll be two months old tomorrow, and my other son Balin. Again, I hope that you are staying healthy. I miss you, and I hope to see you soon. Hi Chestnut Ridge, we miss you. I hope you're doing good. Keep up the good work on your schoolwork. You're doing great. Stay safe, and we'll see you soon. Say bye. 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 <laughs> guessing game which middle school teacher do you think this was if you guessed mrs coral you were right that was me in fourth grade although that was a guessing game there is no guessing that we are missing you we appreciate all the hard work you're putting in at home and your parents work as well and we know that we'll get to see you again very soon hi guys mrs yorkie here i wore my chestnut red shirt just for you I hope you guys are staying safe and enjoying your time with your families. I miss you. Hi, Chestnut Ridge Middle School. This is Mrs. Hearn Kane coming to you from the stairs. Um, there are two reasons I'm on the stairs today. The first is because I have three kids and this is one of the quietest places in the house. They can't find me. Um, the other reason is because I think it's so important to find something to smile about every day. I'm hoping maybe this will give you a little bit of a laugh. I know that times are tough and we are feeling lots of emotions right now, but I've always believed, and if you've had me as your, your teacher, you know, I believe that joking and laughing even through life's toughest moments is how we get through it. So, um, so hopefully the absurdity of me doing schoolwork on the steps every day kind of gives you a little bit of a giggle today. Um, so today, find your reason to smile, find your reason to laugh. Okay, guys. Stay safe, everybody, and we hope to see you soon. Take care. Hey, Chestnut Ridge Middle School. This is Mrs. Porta, and I just wanted to reach out to every one of you and tell you how much I miss you. And I wanted to share a special quote that I think is very appropriate for this uncertain time in our life. Um, it comes from my favorite author, Dr. Seuss, in the story, The Lorax. So unless someone like you cares a whole awful lot, nothing's going to get better. It's not. So please think about that quote. And uh, I think it's very valuable during this time in our lives. And I just wish everybody uh, to stay safe and healthy. Take care, guys. I sure do miss seeing you. But hey, let's look on the bright side. At least this gives us more time to read good books. I know I'm reading one, and I hope you are too. Happy reading. Stay safe. Hey guys, hope you're enjoying your time away from school. Get outside and explore nature. Okay, see you guys back in the fall. Hi everyone. I hope you're having a good time with your family, being able to spend some time together. I've been spending time with mine been playing and reading books, doing some activities together. I hope everyone's staying safe. Miss you. Hi everyone. I hope you are all enjoying spending time with your family. I miss you. Stay safe and healthy. Hi everyone. I miss you. I hope you're doing well. We have been spending a lot of time outside enjoying nature and I hope that you found some things to do too with your time. We can't wait to see you soon. Goodbye. Hi everyone, I miss you all so very much. Stay healthy, stay safe. I can't wait to see you again. Hi! Hi everybody, it's Mrs. Jabrowski. Hope you're doing well and staying safe. We miss you, can't wait to see you again. Hi Chester Ridge! Lions! Since we're lions, has anyone had to tame your mane? 
while in quarantine, this will be Bryce's second time. But I'm qualified because I'm the math teacher, right? I should know what a quarter of an inch is. Uh-oh, Bryce. Looks like I might not know what a quarter of an inch is. That's okay. I'll be cutting his hair anyways. Other things we've been doing to stay busy, after we get our schoolwork done, we like to do some artwork. Today, Bryce, we painted the bottom of his feet and he made you a lion. Other things we like to do, we like to do what, Bryce? Paint rocks. Paint rocks. And we've done this in our lion um, pride and son of day. Go grab a rock from somewhere around your house and paint it however you would like to. We miss Chestnut Ridge, we miss school, and we can't wait to see you again later. Hello, Chestnut Ridge, this is Mr. Wingard. I hope everyone is doing well. I know a lot of you have been bored because you have a lot of downtime, so let me suggest to you that now would be a great time to take up a hobby or learn a new craft. Recently, I've been studying this book because as you know, at least some of you know, I'm a little bit artistically challenged. So I recently completed lesson one, and this is my lesson. Don't judge me. Rome wasn't built in a day. Anyways, I hope everyone is healthy. Keep taking your vitamins, say your prayers, and I will see you in the fall. Chestnut Ridge Middle School, we miss you. Hope you're doing well. We're keeping busy, playing outside, going for walks at the lake, and of course doing our schoolwork. Uh, I hope you're finding fun ways to keep busy yourself, and we hope you're healthy. And as we say in class, stay curious and never stop exploring your world. When some loud bragger tries to put me down and says this school is great. I tell him right away now, what's the matter, buddy? Ain't you heard of my school? It's number one in the state. this morning. I thought you have a job, I said. I thought you have to babysit Fudge. Oh, hi, kids. No, not you guys. I mean, my students. I just wanted to pop in and say hello and introduce you to my friends and tell you that I miss you and I hope you and your families are all staying safe. Bye. Hello, everyone. Just wanted to let you know we're thinking of you and May the force be with you. Millie, say the force be with you. Hi, Chestnut Ridge Middle School. This is Mrs. Midler. Just wanted to tell you guys that I miss you. I hope you're doing well. I hope you're staying strong. Wash your hands. Have a wonderful spring and a summer and get out and play all that you can. I hope to see you again in the fall and we'll do this thing called school. Stay well. Hi, everybody. I am so sad that we are not going to end the year together in the classroom, but I hope you're all staying safe. Hopefully you're able to go outside and get some beautiful sunlight. Um, I just wanted to say that I miss you guys. And number two, you have done an amazing job adjusting to this and doing your assignments and communicating online. I'm so proud of all the work that you guys have done. So keep it up and stay safe. Hi, Chester Ridge Middle School. I miss you. I'm here with my puppies. I hope you guys are all staying safe, getting outside and having some fun in the sun. Hope to see you guys next year and enjoy your summer. you
Mrs. Kohler sure does miss you. She hopes that you're washing your hands, listening to your grown-ups, and staying safe. Hope we can all be back together very soon. Bye! Knock, knock. Who's there? Miss. Miss you. We miss you. This is Mrs. Coons coming to you, hoping everyone's staying healthy, safe, and having lots of fun. Bye! Hi everyone, it's Miss Newland. I just wanted to let you know that we miss you so much and we're super proud of all the hard work you're doing in online learning. I hope you find something each day that makes you smile and brings you joy. Stay safe and we hope to see you soon. Hi boys and girls at Chestnut Ridge Middle School. Mrs. Emmerich here and with my dog, as you can see, my son is holding a toy up for her. Uh, we are having a good time here at home. Uh, however, I miss seeing everybody at school. I miss your hugs and high fives and smiles. So take care and make the most of this time that we have off and we'll see you in the fall. Bye-bye. Hi students, I miss seeing you. I hope you're keeping busy with activity. Um, please stay safe. Yeah. And this, yeah. I've been spending time with my yeah. granddaughter, Tenley. Yeah. What's wrong? Can you say hi to the boys and girls? Say hi. Hi all you middle school students from Chestnut Ridge. This is Mrs. Clark, school counselor, and my daughter Meredith. And we're coming to you live from our house in our backyard. And um, Meredith is kind of like you all right now. She's a college student, however, at Indiana University of Pennsylvania, IUP. <laughs> And she's taking classes in the living room, just like most of you are doing. Yes, they sent the college students home and they're taking classes here at home. So not only are we, uh, of course, doing classwork, but we're also doing some fun things. Meredith likes to have a project in the summer. And um, one of the things that we're working on right now is gardening. We have various things that we're going to use to do some planting, but Meredith, can you tell them about this item? Yeah. This is a raised bed, so it's designed for flowers that need dry soil, so all the water that isn't used will just go right through it. So that's what that's for. And Meredith is picking out specific plants this year, or flowers, because of her second project, and that second project is going to tie into my loss group. We talked about caterpillars and butterflies and the life cycles and how that um, kind of deals with death of loved ones. So Meredith, what is this? This is a butterfly biome. So I will be having two types of butterflies in here this summer. And I covered the bottom with moss and a couple pebbles. And we have this vine for them to grow their chrysalises on. So that's some of the projects that we're doing. We hope that you all will have some fun projects aside from your schoolwork and take care and we'll see you in the fall. Hey guys, this is Mr. Rizzo. I know many of you may find this quarantine unbearable and I'd be lying if I said I didn't miss you. Make sure you don't spend too much time playing video games and get outside and have some fun. I just want you all to know that I miss you so much. Yes, I love spending time with my family, but I miss my school kids too. Hi everybody, how's everyone holding up? We sure do miss you guys and wish we were back at school so we could see your smiling faces. But since we can't, uh, we thought this would be the ne next best thing is send you guys a video so you can see our smiling faces. Anyway, hope everyone's doing well. Hope everyone's healthy and enjoying time with your family and doing your schoolwork and getting outside and getting some fresh air. Don't forget to pick up a book and read it also. 
And uh, I also want to take this opportunity to also let you guys know, I wanted to talk to you guys in May about it, but since we're not in the classroom, I can't do that. I wanted to let you guys know that I am retiring this school year. I will not be back in the fall when we, when we start back up with school. And I wanted to let you know myself. And so since we're not at school, this is the best way I can do it. I want to thank you guys for being in my life. I want to, I, some of you guys I've known since kindergarten. And it's bittersweet for me. I know I'm going to miss you guys. And with that being said, I've decided I may just come in once or twice uh, a month or even more a little bit and do some substituting just so I can see your smiling faces. But anyway, um, I wanted to let you know I am retiring. You will be left in good hands, I assure you. The next person that takes over in the library, you will love. And uh, with that being said, we'll see you guys here sometime. All right. Love you guys and we miss you. Bye-bye. I am really missing you and a day with you would be perfect. Hello, everyone. Just wanted to say that I'm missing out seeing you guys every day and the normalcy of the schedule and all that. I've gotten a lot of cool project ideas from you guys. So keep up the good work and keep trying your best to make sure you're doing this the way you're supposed to and keep staying safe and putting in that great effort. Hello, all my Chestnut Ridge people. I miss you guys so much. I hope you're staying safe, keeping your hands clean, and staying away from people. One of these days soon, we're going to get all back together, and this will all be over. But for now, we're all in it together. Hi, just wanted to say hi to everybody. Hope you're doing well. Miss all of your smiling faces. Um, in the hallways and those classes that I get to go into. Um, looking forward to seeing all of you when we return. Hi everybody, it's Mrs. Wagner. I just wanted to say how much I miss you guys and hope that everyone is doing great. Um, I've heard from so many of you and I really appreciate that. It's been really, really nice. Um, thank you very much for responding to the stuff I put on um, for you guys to do. I hope you're enjoying it, and um, I hope you're staying safe and um, having a nice time. I can't wait till the fall. I hope we're all back together again and singing and seeing each other every day. That will be really, really nice. All right. Thank you for listening. Bye. Hi everyone, Mrs. Brown here. Just wanted to say that we miss you, we're thinking about you, and we hope that you're all staying safe and doing well. Um, I can't wait until we can all get back together again at school and everything's back to normal. I hope you're all doing well. Take care. Bye. Hi everyone, this is Mrs. Witkowski. We wanted to let you know that we miss all of you very much. I hope while you are at home, that you continue to keep your minds and your bodies active. That could maybe mean reading a new book, writing in a journal. Maybe you go outside to get some extra exercise. If the weather's good, hasn't been real great lately, it seems like it's raining a lot. Bake some cookies, um, cook a meal, help cook a meal. Those are things that I like to do. Or maybe you just wanna watch a movie to relax and make you laugh. Um, this next thing I didn't write, I saw it on someone's post and I liked it so I wanted to share it. It's kind of like a Dr. Seuss thought and it says, I will teach you in a room. I will teach you now on Zoom. I will teach you in your house. I will teach you with a mouse. I will teach you here and there. I will teach you because I care. I will teach you so just do your best and do not worry about the rest. So continue to do your best to challenge yourself just to have some fun. Um, I hope that you are staying safe and staying healthy. And the most important thing to remember is to keep smiling. Be where trouble melts like lemon drops high above the chimney top that's where